safeguarding is hugely important. It runs through Superjam. It's at the very start of the day, the very end of the day and beyond. It is about keeping students and staff safe. And it's everything we do. It's in the classrooms, it's everywhere. Um, the students know this, the staff know this. It's about keeping us all safe and happy where we work and study. We put the young person first. We work tirelessly with the person as an individual and we really try to make an inclusive environment. Like we're always working on different ways that we can work with individuals. What works with one might not work with the other. So I think it's just about protecting the young person, however that looks for that individual. Mainstream schools often have uh, thousands of students and you can get very lost in the tide, particularly if you've got learning disabilities or if you've had some sort of trauma in your life. So at Superjam, we keep the colleges under 100 students. So we have that familiarity. Everyone knows everyone else. You have this wonderful family atmosphere. And we have a wonderful, wonderful group of staff. So all of the team that work here feel passionate about the students and about what they do. And we have a large amount of them as well. You know, for 100 students, we've got 65 staff. When they come to Superjam, they know they're going to be listened to. They know that they'll get some counselling if that's what they need. They'll know they'll get the support educationally. They'll also know that they'll get the emotional support that they need because we all need that. And to create that safe space, it's kind of the glue that holds Superjam together. It's a safe, caring, kind organisation that uses the power of music to inspire our young people to want to achieve and most importantly, to want to progress on when they come to us. Safeguarding is the most important thing. So how is the young person? How are they doing financially? How is the family doing financially? Are you eating? And that, that's one of my things. As soon as students come in in the morning, I'll be like, have you had your breakfast? And we do breakfast club here. So the students will have their once a weekly session. And this can look at things that range from personal hygiene to healthy boundaries, to healthy relationships. Um, we can also look at things like sexual health, substance use um, and alcohol use. So it creates a safe environment for these students to be able to talk about these issues that may be facing them every day. You get the right support. There's lovely people, both staff and students. You're very well respected. And if there's any help that you need, the staff are always there and you can always feel free to talk to someone. The emotional and pastoral care that I received through Superjam has really, really helped me. Just come to college and on my bad days, knowing that it's okay to have a bad day, on my good days, lifting me up even higher. Life gets in the way sometimes and there are things that you can't control happening, but Superjam do really, really help to make sure that that doesn't affect your learning. Especially while I've been going through a tough time at the moment, like they have been so supportive and uh, even if I'm um, on a down day, like, I start writing a song about how I've been feeling. And that's the way that I express my emotions, is by writing my, my own songs. We think uh, mental health wellbeing is really important to us. And actually, it makes us better people and a better team player. And that's the Super Jam ethos. It's about caring and nurturing and being there for each other. We believe that the well-being and personal side of a student's life is just as important, if not more important, than the academic side. And we want that to be fulfilled to the best of our ability so the students can thrive uh, successfully here with their time at Superjam.